Welcome back to Solid Cam Pro. In this exercise, we are going to create this sheet metal part in Inventor. As we see here, we have this punch here, and this punch we are going to create by using sweep and revolve command. For the dimension, we have this drawing, and we are going to follow this drawing step by step in order to create our model. Just if you look here on the front uh, view, we have the scale one to one, and we have the distance from here to here 150 and uh, we have this radius here uh, the inner radius 27 and the outer radius 33 so between these two radius we have 30 millimeter radius so we have these two flanges we have the dimension here the height 50 millimeter and the width you can see here 50 millimeter and the thickness of this sheet metal we have six millimeter and the radius of this edge here we have 40 millimeter and uh, we have this punch here you can see here the outer radius 10 millimeter the inner radius 4 millimeter so let's start to create our model select new project sheet metal create select sketch front plane draw a line draw an arc 90 degree and this arc and, and this line must be tangent the same here must be tangent and now select line a line this line must be horizontal draw another line on this side and now select coincidence select midpoint of this sketch and select the center of our plane now give a dimension 150 millimeter and for this line we have 50 millimeter 50 millimeter radius 30 millimeter and radius for this one 30 millimeter finish sketch select contour flange now we need this distance 80 millimeter and the thickness must place it on the center of our sketch select this one center apply change the thickness 6 millimeter apply and now select flange select this edge the height 50 millimeter and the width 50 millimeter and select bend position select this one The angle 90 degree apply select this edge change direction downward and we have the width 50 millimeter the height 50 millimeter apply now select corner round give a dimension 25 millimeter like this corner and this one this one and this one apply and the same for this one 40 millimeter like this corner and this corner apply cancel 
Now select whole command. Select this surface. And select this edge. So the hole will be placed on the center of this radius here. Dimension radius uh, diameter 60 millimeter apply and the same for this one select this edge 60 millimeter okay now we are going to create this uh, punch here so select unfold select this surface add all bands apply create new sketch here select this surface new sketch and now select project geometry select this edge and this edge draw a line on the center convert this line to construction line select slot we want this sketch to place on the center of this part so select this horizontal constraint select this point and select this point now we'll give a dimension 10 from this point to this point 30 millimeter and from this point to this point 30 millimeter now finish sketch select cut and select this profile and the thickness of this sheet metal six millimeter and this cutout will be six millimeter so apply okay select refold select this one add all bands apply now we are going to create a plane here select plane three point select this point and this point and this point now we have this plane and uh, let's create a sketch here select this plane and make invisible I'll draw a line from here to here draw another line from here to here draw an arc from here to here give a dimension 10 delete this one and delete this unnecessary line now make an offset 6 millimeter let's draw a line up to here from here to here now we have this outer radius 10 millimeter and we have this radius 4 millimeter as we see here we can see on the drawing here we have this inner radius 4 millimeter the outer radius 10 millimeter now finish sketch and now we are going to create another plane on the center between this side and this another side so select plane mid plane select this 
surface and select this surface so we have this plane on the center let's create new sketch now select project geometry select this edge and select this edge this edge this edge and this one and select this edge here. sorry this one let's delete this one so now finish the sketch hide this plane select sweep command select this profile and the pass the pass must be on this select the curve line here okay now we are going to create sketch here select line draw a line from this point to this line the same from this point to this line here select arc yes we can select project geometry first select this one draw an arc to the center here here the same here select project geometry draw an arc to the center draw a line from this point to this point now delete these all unnecessary lines delete this one delete this one and delete this one now finish the sketch select revolve command select this profile and the revolution select this axis like this but not the 360 degree just we want up to this surface select this one up to this surface like this change direction like this one Now we have to change this this must be connected this and this part select this revolve future here and select the direction we must change the direction like this one see here this revolve start from here and finishing here and select this surface like this one now you can see here this profile start here and finish it here okay and we have to create new sketch here the same process draw a line from this point to this line from this point to this line select project geometry select this one and this one 
draw an arc to the center 10 millimeter radius from this point to the center 4 millimeter radius and now draw a line from this point to this point delete this all unnecessary line now finish the sketch select revolve command again select the axis this one and now as we see here this uh, revolve start from this and uh, and the revolution 360 degree so select this one select this surface now we can see on the preview okay now we are going to apply fillet select fillet command give it dimension 6 millimeter and the same for this one 6 millimeter you can see this fillet dimension here we have uh, six millimeter this is the outer radius here the inner radius you can see here six millimeter so now we are going to apply color as you can select anyone we want from here for now i'm going to select this one so now our model is finished uh, you can find this drawing on my youtube channel on the community tab if you want to practice on your own so you can find there and for more video and more project in inventor please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching